going to be our debut season this year but uh, our language of uh, design has been evolving for the last 15 years earlier we were making creative clothes and it was spread so it was you know fun fashion for evening wear for going out but now this is another level of the same fashion that we were making this is like taking it to another level altogether and i think yeah the last 10 years have given us the confidence to take this next big step forward each collection is like a story unfolding we want to make it glitzy make it beautiful sophisticated glamour is what we are looking for something that is exciting a new contemporary version of couture we've always been about technique so you know um we've never really made plain clothes it's in our pret collections also i mean we've done prints which is about as plain as we can get but uh, we've always been about embroidery embellishments surface ornamentation uh, you know our traditional appliques will be seen of course uh, at couture week but done in a new avatar and uh, it will be more shiny than seen before Honestly, before the fashion weeks uh, became an organized thing in our country, uh, fashion was very disorganized, and it was there, but it wasn't run professionally. I feel uh, there was lots to do. So, with the formation of the FDCI and the formation of an organized calendar of fashion weeks, it imbibed a sense of discipline in the whole industry, not just us. The FDCI has been very supportive of the creative environment. You know, it's uh, you know when you do your shows, uh, you can do the most amazing outlandish sets. Uh, the best models are there to wear your clothes. Uh, the best choreography teams are there, makeup teams. You know, the best talent that this country has had to offer. Mm -hmm.